you guys super random, but I wanted to show you this. I got some like really cute boots from this brand called Ego, but it like arrived. Look at how damaged the box is. It just seemed like this was sitting in the warehouse for a really long time or something. But anyways, the shoes are cute. I'll show you. Hey guys, I'm not sure where the clip went where I was supposed to show you guys the boots, but here they are. I think I got a six and a half. These boots are kind of weird because the sides, they would fit very like tight and like my calf area. So I'm glad I got a six and a half, but then in the shoe area, like in the back over here, it's a little bit big. So I feel like maybe the six would have fit better in like right here. I mean, it's really, it's like tight on the side. So Whatever, I just wear like thick socks and kind of just deal with it. Reminds me of Bottega Veneta boots. Like I love this detail on it. I wanted to get something that kind of looked like my Koei boots, but a little bit different because I didn't want to get like the same exact style. But it has a tab in the front and a tab in the back, which I really like that for some reason. And then these are what the sides look like. So yeah, they're pretty comfortable if they just, they would be more comfortable if they fit me right here, but it's okay. I mean, they're like $50, so whatever. Okay, so another thing I wanted to mention was the Screwball Whiskey. This is so good if you like sweet stuff. It tastes like sweet and like kind of syrupy, I guess. Hold on. Let me smell it again. I forgot. It tastes like vanilla butterscotch. It smells very sweet, but it's peanut butter whiskey and it's so good. This would go really good with like ice cream or like in coffee, maybe hot chocolate. Hello everyone. I just got my second COVID shot. So far so good. I got it done at like 9.15 this morning and right now it is 6.50. So a few hours after I got it done, maybe like the first two hours or something, I did feel a little bit tired. But other than that, like I feel fine. They did say that most people don't really feel um, symptoms until uh, 10 hours after. So in 10 hours, it'll be, I can't do the math, 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, so 7 p.m., which is coming up soon. So I'm gonna hurry up and eat my Chipotle. I got Chipotle again. If I feel good, I'm gonna film a haul, and it's by Manu Dubois. I think that's, I'm saying it, Manu Dubois. I think I'm saying it correctly. I've never ordered from them before and I got a lot. I got like eight pieces or seven pieces or something like that. And I really hope they work out because if not, I heard horror stories about the return procedure. Um, I saw Tomorrow War this morning and it was okay. It, it actually got a lot of stars, but I don't know. I felt like some parts were like kind of corny to me, but it was okay. <laughs> That's all I'm gonna say. There is a movie on um, Prime that I really like that I wanted to let you guys know about. I took a picture of it because I forgot. It's called Britney Runs a Marathon. So that was pretty good if you guys wanna watch something like comedy, drama. Yeah, Britney Runs a Marathon. That was good, I really enjoyed that. I just got back from alterations. I did a, I filmed a haul video today on Manure de Bois. They have clothes that I think of in my head because sometimes I'll have like visions in my head on what type of like bodysuit I want, what type of pants I want, but it doesn't exist until I came across their Instagram and I was like, oh my gosh, this is like all the things that I think of when I think of like a bodysuit I want or pants that I want or like just like outfits that I want. They're very like street style, edgy. It's so cool. I love it. So I got done filming that. Then I went to alterations, which I'm kind of nervous because I couldn't really understand the lady. So I'm hoping that it turns out good because I'm just, I'm, I'm so nervous. And I hope they keep the pieces when they alter because what if I don't like it? Like, are they able to salvage the pieces and then like put it back together like i don't know but anyways i also want to let you guys know that this is the second day um from me getting the COVID shot my second dose of the pfizer vaccine i was feeling pretty good throughout the whole day i got a little bit tired like a few hours after but that went away and then yeah i felt totally fine i was like did they even give me the vaccine i got my vaccine at 9 15 
At 11.45, I started to get chills and I was like, uh-oh. And like I'd get chills like on and off and like I took a shower and everything and then I went to bed and during the night like I was super sweaty like the back of my hair was like soaking wet but I was still able to sleep like it's not like it like kept me up all night I did feel a little bit like warm around my head and neck area but nothing like a fever it just felt warm like, I don't know how to explain it, just warm. Then I woke up at 9.30 in the morning and had like a headache. So I took two Tylenol and I went back to sleep and woke up at 1.30 and felt great and I felt fine. So yeah, that's my little update. And right now I'm eating gnocchi and with cucumbers and balsamic. And I'm just going to um, eat this and then get ready for bed. Just like watch some TV. Um, mm, and that's it. Good. Bye. Good morning. I know I'd be looking, you know, a little rough, but I wanted to show you guys my package that I got. Well, it's something that I ordered. It is shoes from Karl Lagerfeld. So they have a Karl Lagerfeld outlet, which is karllagerfeldparis.com, and then they have karl.com, which is not the outlet. I got it from not the outlet store. Oh my God. It is packaged so nicely, I have to show you. Look at how neatly packaged that is. Wow, everything is so neat. Wow, wow, wow. It's like opening up a present. So this is what the box looks like. Oh, it comes with a dust bag. Fancy, fancy. So here's the dust bag. It's just like a cloth material. Kind of reminds me of um, the Saint Laurent ones. Oh, these look kind of big. So this is what I got. These are white booties. Um, and it has this like pink K block heel. It's only like two inches. Hopefully these are comfortable. And it has a little um, tag thing right here. And then a silver zipper in the front. Oh, and they even have like right here, it's like scratchy so you don't, so it's not slippery. That's really cool. I just love that it had that pink at the bottom. I thought it gave it like a really nice flare, especially when I'm wearing a lot of black and white. Like a little pop of color is nice, you know? They're so comfy. They seem so comfy, especially because they're only like two inch heels. I can kind of feel like my toes overlapping in this leg. And this leg right here. Maybe we should move this. Oh. Very cute. I love it. I like that it's pointed toed. I don't mind the silver zipper. I kind of wish the silver zipper wasn't there and that was on the side, but it's okay. Yeah, I really like these. These are very comfortable. Oh my gosh. So in love with these boots. They are very comfortable, and I feel like I have big calves kind of well bigger than normal and i feel like it fits really well i mean it i feel like it's a little bit loose up here which i like um because i hate it when it feels like second skin you know but i love the fit of it oh my gosh it feels so good and it's so comfortable because the heels like the block heel is only like two inches i think and because it's a chunky block heel it feels very comfortable I love the pointed toe. I feel like when you have pointed toe, it like elongates your legs and like just makes it look a lot more like put together, you know? And this feels so comfortable. It's thin. I honestly thought it was going to come up a little bit higher because I thought the model was like 5'8 and it looked like it came like above her knee. Maybe it's because she was wearing like a bigger size than me. So in both boots, I got a size six and I feel like it's definitely true to size. I was going to say true to fit, true to size. 
And um, you guys, I'm like so in love. I mean, I've always been into Karl Lagerfeld stuff, but I never tried on their shoes. And these are so nice. Uh, I mean, these aren't at the outlet mall. This one is at the regular website. But oh my god, the black heel. I wish they had one where it was like solid black, but this one's cool too. It's it looks like oil, you know, it's got like that rainbowy. It reminds me of like oil, you know what I mean? Um, I'm gonna leave it in the description box, a link to it. Like, I feel like this part might slide down once in a while, but also not. So, I'm gonna wear it to work next week and I will give you an update.